Hello friends and family and Lia mains. Today we're going to play Pantheon mid on Europe Nordican East in Grandmaster and we're going to see how we do against Lissandra on mid lane with Aftershock obviously. This is going to be a guide on how to play Pantheon and how I generally play to get some free LP when I can. Hopefully this will be the case to win and to do fine with it. Now if we analyze the comps they do have a Protect the Jinx comp with Lissandra having the CC, Shen having the ult, Lulu having the ult, Gragas being there as well to disrupt them. So our goal for this game is probably to let, uh, to destroy Jinx early so that she does not get ahead and to close the game before she becomes a nuisance and very annoying. Now, if Shen is mid, I actually enjoy it because he's less of a cock block than the Lissandra. And we're going to try to actually destroy this game to win. Uh, I'm playing Pantheon, Jung, uh, Pantheon mid with Press the Attack. Triumph, Legend Tenacity, Cup the Grace, Bone Plating, Unflinching, and these rune stats. Basically, uh, since the Conqueror change, I really like to play press the attack, and I like Le Legend Tenacity, Bone Plating, and Unflinching because of the amount of tenacity it gives. And we're against a lot of CC, so that would be a good plan. Also, I expect the Shen to be honest on mid. Oh, okay, it's fine. Also, as I said, we're playing, we're playing with. Uh, Corrupting Potion and we're going for something like Humus, Tenacity Boots definitely and we're going to see after that. Okay, we proc'd that, she didn't uh, She didn't start with W, it's fine, we won the trade and we have to farm better than that. Okay, I'm gonna jump on her again because we can proc over and over that. Okay, okay, we do that again and again till she gets bored of us. And we're gonna jump in four seconds again on her. I'm gonna miss that CS, but we can get actually a kill. She will proc, she will proc W. But we can actually bait it out. We can actually bait it out. And I lost some CS. It's fine. The wave's going to come towards me. We're gonna bait it out right now with W. So she misses some CS. Maybe that CS too. Okay, nice, nice, nice. And we're going to be just one CS behind now. Okay, we used one stack of Corrupting Potion, I'm gonna miss that CS because I pressed up. Nice! That's extremely nice, now if Jinx doesn't get a double kill or something. Okay. And we have to use Q here, because I want to start to slowly push. And we wanna jump on her, and if uh, Gragas comes, uh, we're going to be fine. I'm gonna hit another Q there, because I was minion blocked. Alright, we're, we're at the same number of CS. Lissandra is playing very defensive, for some reason. If Gragas is bot, it's a problem. If he stop, it's actually good. Oh, Jesus, I missed so much CS. But yeah, she loses CS now as well with this because she pushes, but she's afraid to come close, which means we're actually having advantage. Okay, she teleported bot. We don't reach that in time. Definitely not playing with teleport, but she lost a lot now. If she, if Gragas is not there, he is okay. I can't actually follow. I definitely can't follow. So I just have to push. She actually does her job right, but she lost a lot of experience with this. And I haven't pushed in time. Maybe she was going to reach mid again. And we're going to do fine. Kha'Zix got a kill. That's what I liked about it. We can actually move towards bot now. Because Jinx is out of mana, but she will recall. So we can dip ward somewhere. We can look around here. Okay, we see Gragas. Go around here, maybe. Okay, they will recall, but it's fine. I'm gonna also use ult on bot at a certain point. And we're gonna do just fine. She is behind 10 CS. And that teleport was honestly expected. And now if um, if Gragas comes here, I will be actually fine. Because Kha'Zix is nearby. And if they jump on me, I will actually enjoy it. Because we can actually destroy them. Come, 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 come. Flash. Okay. Actually, Kazix went to the top side. She can get. He can get a kill there. Okay. As, as you've seen, that worked. Can't reach to help him because I flashed. So it's fine. As you've seen, that actually that plan worked because he did not expect the Kazix there, and she did not have the word because she did not have time to put it there. Okay. She probably still has corrupting potion stack, so I expect her to uh, be still around here if she recalled. Then she's going to lose a lot. I want to push this. I want to actually jump on her here. Could probably kill her if I do a full combo. Okay, we see we see Kha'Zix. We need to go there to help. I'm gonna put 
out of word here, gonna back off. She needs to escape, she, he needs to escape to go away from there. And Shen should be actually first, but it seems that, okay, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. I think they recalled, I don't think Ragas comes from the long way around. And I'm making six here. I'm making six and I can actually jump. I could actually jump here on Jinx, like this. She has no no spells to actually do anything. Get the Lulu as well, okay. So we basically won bot lane now with that. That was a very, very quick... Uh, man, 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 I'm free far. That was a very quick ult. She definitely did not have time to react to it or to expect, so that's why we got there that advantage. Also, instant magic resist boots because of the amount of CC. Come on, get, get, get farm. I want Kha'Zix to get as much farm as possible. As much farm as possible to actually go and uh, destroy that Gragas later on. Because he's the assassin, right? He needs to kill people instantly. And if he's obnoxiously fed, then they have absolutely no chance to come back. Okay, I don't like that, but okay, I guess. Don't ping him, come on, let him. It's fine, I guess. Okay, so for items, as I said, I'm going for magic resist boots because we're against so much uh, CC and so much uh, AP because they do have a lot of that. And after that, we're going for Yumus into Black Cleaver or maybe even some other magic resist or armor because if I have magic resist, then I could go for some other stuff. But here, we need to keep abusing the fact that Jinx is Diamond 2. Okay, so we catch a little here. We got another kill here. Get it to the uh, to the Jinx, to the Xia, sorry. And now we come towards here and we start the fight. Uh, hopefully, hopefully she does not. He does not die. Okay, I think I, I think I can jump. Okay, jump. Okay, get the Jinx. Okay, so that's how we play as a team. That went well. Also, I think they are somewhere around Diamond Dilo because uh, because they uh, int a bit too much, to be honest. Uh, I'm not. I'm not doing well here. Okay, that's actually I got saved. Actually, I got saved. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. Back off. Back off. Back off. Gragas is level six, but he's behind Kazix in farm and everything else, and Shen just teleported back. So. Man, stay for the plate, maybe you get the plate, man. man. Okay, so so we, we started to roll over this game, over to, to start to destroy them, to destroy them to get the advantage. And... Ult, ult, nice. I don't think they know, but you should go away, you should go away. I'm coming, but you should go away. Man. Man. Why? You had flash. And also on bot. Okay, I could jump on bot. Perhaps I could kill her before uh, they actually come. Okay, that's that's a plan. Didn't consider that part. Come, 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 we fight, we fight. We, we definitely are allowed to fight here. Okay. If Gragas turns here, then I'll be actual. I, I'll be actually fine because I'm gonna use the E. But we got the double kill on them right there, so it's okay. We lost the Drake, but we got the double kill, and I can just farm at this point. I could have forced it. I could have flashed. I could have done more, but it's fine. He doesn't have even. He doesn't have credit for man. That's that's an odd game, but yeah, I'll take the LP. Also, I have to be alive this game a lot because if I give a bounty to them, then that's going to be extremely costful, honestly. So I'm just gonna recall here. We're gonna cast it if he comes. I'm staying with Shifty right around to cast it instantly. And so we are doing pretty much fine for now. We have 13 CS advantage. Lissandra is behind, like almost two levels if I take this wave. Not sure if you make 7 out of it. And we have a Tariq. That Tariq is going to be extremely strong. 
Because it buys us time to actually jump on Jinx and kill her. That's the purpose. Okay, if she doesn't make... Okay, she make level 7. I'm going to make level 8 soon here. Not really an entire level, but we're there. We're going there. Okay. I'll cast the Q. Okay, after this minion we got it. She's missing. She's missing. Careful, I ping myself actually by accident. Okay, we lost one CS. We should stop losing CS. Okay, we back off here. We go towards mid. We reduce this vision ward and put it, put it here. And she pushes now. She pushes. She probably expects me to actually go. Okay, I don't see anyone on the map, so we could just, could just jump on her here. But back off after that. Don't don't force. We don't force right now. We let her miss this wave. She, uh, we didn't. Okay, it's fine. She has to recall now. We, I have ultimate in some seconds. And Gragas is bot. Gragas is bot. Back off. Back off. They will back off instantly because I disappeared from the mid lane. But Lissandra might have teleport. So I'm just gonna have to hard shove mid and then ult bot. That's the goal. That's the goal right here. When I see the teleport of hers, if she does it, I'm not gonna miss that. Okay, jumping, jumping, jumping. Oh boy. Okay, I'm gonna flash out. It's okay. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Perfect dive. Josh yeah, and ult! That was a bad dive, but I guess. Run, run. Okay, okay, go away. Go away. It's fine. I could just keep running here. I don't. I don't even need to flash because I outrun him very, very well. What did you do? Why are you here? Jesus! Why? That that was hinting from her. And why is this tower still up? Why is he low HP? I have so many questions. So many questions. But the inting was not cool. I mean, we could have killed... I should have dived there. That was the mistake. Should have dived on Jinx. Oh, okay, that's why he's low HP. Should have died on Jinx before she actually had time to get ulted by Shen. So that was the mistake. But still, Lissandra is 0-5. She's basically useless. Just a CC bot. Gragas is fed, but he won't have... He, he's not scaling that right. Okay, he's not going to carry this alone or stuff like that. And we need the next Drake. I'm gonna cast a Q here. And probably gonna going to be able to get some plates. Okay. And considering how I started that, we did actually pretty fine. Okay, come on. Get me another plate here at least. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on with the plate. Come on with the plates. Okay. You should, you should. Man, you had time for Herald. Okay, they used everything there, but they don't have the damage. I can just Yumus away if they come. This might be greedy. Where is the rest of them? Okay. Get her. That's fine. Okay. I mean, you're okay. 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 This is fine. I hope. Okay. Get him. Ah. Uh, it's, it's okay. It's okay. It went fine. It went very fine for us. Okay. We can go now for... Uh, we go for Black Cleaver. I don't think we need armor yet. We will probably get armor, but not right now. We got the shutdown on... Uh, Gragas, I think. They also got the shutdown on me, but we need to get first tower. We have so many options of first towering. Mm, yeah, it's fine. We need to keep the experience and level advantage over that, and Shen will ult. Shen will definitely ult now. Come, come here, come here, come here. Come here. Okay. I'm gonna put 
it here. Come on, drag it out. Drag it out. Shen can ult, but we have to get it in time. Okay, 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 good, 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 good. Mini stun. That mini stun actually probably. Okay, okay, it's. We back off a bit, we back off a bit. Okay, Shen is low HP. Get the Shen. Okay. I guess. Jump here, jump here, jump here. Okay, this is fine. This is, uh, this is a good corner. Here, what did Mordekaiser do? Okay, get the Gragas. Get the Lolo. Nice. That was a good. That was a good Yolo by the Mordekaiser. But <laughs> man, I'm two one nine. Jesus. Oh my god, really? Your passive gets proc from that? I didn't even know that. Come on, back off. It's fine. I'm 2 on 9. I'm support here. Very much supporting this. But yeah, we did very fine in those fights. And Lissandra keeps hinting, so that's what, uh, that's what helps us. I mean, she tries to protect. I understand her position. She tries to protect the ADC. So let's see if we can now get the Jinx without... Uh, I vote for the fact that Lulu will go for words. And Jinx will start to push. That's my prediction. Back off. Back off. Back off. Back off. Back off. Back off. What are you doing? What was that, Tari? If she ulted you, you might have died. So, if we, we voted for the fact that Jinx is going to start pushing, right? So, we can go for this. We can go here. They have no hurts. We have time to actually reach it if she doesn't use the BQ. Okay. Okay, she used it. I could go around. Could go around like this. And wait. I wanna wait here because if she comes towards this zone. Okay, no, 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 no. Okay, so I got the jinx for free. I get this as well. So that was a proper positioning, right? And Jinx was farming there solo alone. We got the free kill. And we have now a lot more advantage than we had before. Because we just nullified her farming ability. We just got her back. And we can actually repeat it. We can actually push it. And then when she comes to farm, we can ult on top of her. And we have ignite that this time. And we have other stuff as well. Uh, such as a better positioning. So I'm just going to do this. And then I'm gonna bow back and wait. Back off. I could ult here. Could definitely ult here as well. Back off. I just wanna ult on Jinx. Yep, I wanna ult on Jinx here, even though we might do something stupid. Okay, I'm seeing Jinx on mid. Okay, okay, I got her, I got her, I got her, I got her, I got her. Oh, never mind. That actually went well. If I dodge the alt, it it went actually well, yeah. Because Gragas ulted for that, and she had time to react. If Gragas wouldn't be there, that would have changed probably the discussion of that engage. All right. Yep, yep. We have time to. We have time. We have. We have time to get it. Get it. Get, get it. And then Drake. And then Drake. So, as we see, we can do that, we can keep doing this, we can keep jumping on Jinx, and we need, we need Xayah to, oh boy, uh, if Xakasix dies there, it's not cool. Man, get out, just let Tarik die. Actually, I'm gonna cast this on Baron so that it starts damaging them. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. We didn't lose anything. Back off. Man, 
man. That was actually nice. Really nice flash. That changed very much the engage. But we won't be able to fight for it probably. Man, we could we could we could we could We should have. We should have started Baron there. But Zaya recalled, he could have healed maybe. Yeah, we have to pass it. Don't What are you doing? Don't. That's a free death for you if you go there. Okay. He got that, he put Herald on mid. Go away, go back. I need to start clearing around. Okay, another vision word here. Now we can move here. This is the spot where we want to move. Right here. Come here, come here, come here. Okay, 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 I got the Lulu. Okay, good, 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 good. Back off, back off, back off. Oh man, okay, it's fine. Okay. Okay, great. Baron, free Baron. I have flash. Yeah, we could we could offer a free Baron here. I could also flash on top of Jinx. I think I will flash on top of Jinx. But we can just get this for free, honestly. Go Baron, 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 Baron. We still have time. We could actually trap them, maybe? Because they will just go full animalistic. Okay, Shen, Shen. You just gotta be careful to the other. Okay, oh my god, Kha'Zix with a freaking ult from Tarik. Penta? Penta? Okay, I guess that's it. <laughs> 17 kills Kha'Zix. We got him fed nicely, I suppose. Oh, She actually gives him... Just, just don't steal it, man. Don't be a dick. Man. That's a dick. That's a very much a dick there. Okay. He, he trolled. He trolled so much. That's just sad, man. He could have had the pen time. I'm just... I'm very sad now. Okay. So that's the game. Grandmaster Pantheon game, by the way, against some diamonds, I guess. Not everyone is here. But I suppose... Oh my god. Man, I'm getting destroyed by Lulu here. You leave me alone. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna ruin my KD for that. Can we kindly finish this? So I guess that was the game. I really hope you enjoyed on how I generally play Pantheon. You've seen some roams that actually cost them a lot. Lissandra roamed early, so that was her advantage, but she lost a lot after that. If you roam that early with Lissandra and you are against a heavy assassin or bruiser, you're going to struggle because even if you play extremely defensive, you're not going to have damage, and that's what happened, and she basically stopped being useful at all, even though she tried to get Jinx ahead, and Jinx wasn't going to get ahead until the mid to late game, and in the mid to late game we were too fed to actually uh, do so and she pra practically lost mid lane very early uh, Jinx inted a lot because I well I can't say she inted a lot because I also ulted properly and we did some pretty good fights and Shen didn't while Shen ulted properly he didn't have the impact more the guys eventually had I guess so that's what settles it that was the game I really hope you enjoyed it I'm getting only two honors apparently and 
I had a pretty good KDA to be honest, pretty, played pretty good. I really hope you enjoyed it, and we also got the Jinx after that, so see you next time, focus on, as I focus on them, try to get the ADC if she's the only damage dealer in the team, and you're going to see, Gragas started 4-1 this game, he's 5-7 by the way at the end of the game, so it doesn't matter if some champions get fed unless they are capable of hard carrying or have capabilities, not the player but the champion, because Mastery, a fed Mastery will carry much more easy than any other fed champions in the jungle, so Gragas not really. Let's try to pass the kills to your ADC would be the advice. That was the game, guys, again for the fourth time. I really hope you enjoyed it and have a nice day and night. I really hope, I really like the fact that you watch my videos and I'm not really good at ending things, so <laughs> I guess goodbye.